Assalamu alaikum everyone. How are you all? Wa alaikum assalam. Fine, Miss. What about you? Alhamdulillah. How are you doing? Thank you so much. So, ladies, today is the practice session of Chapter Eight, Lesson Four. Today, I'm having two assistants, Marwa and Aisha Jumaa. So, Marwa, can you share your screen and start? Yes, Miss, I will know. If you are having an audio, share your screen with the audio, dear. Hi, my name is Marwa. I will revise with you our learning outcomes of today, and I will tell you what will be the aim of this lesson. Today, I'm the assistant of Ms. Dina, and if you need help, you can get back to me. Lesson today in chapter 8, lesson 4, solving logarithmic equations and inequalities. So we were done from the prior knowledge test in the LMS, and it was in logarithmic expressions. Also, we were done from the learning objective 1, solving logarithmic equations on parent functions and with transformations. And yesterday, we were done from learning objective 2, Solving logarithmic inequalities on parent functions and with transformations. And finally, today we will have teamwork as a practice session. For whatever we, we take and learning outcome one and learning outcome two. And my friend now, Aisha Jumha, will tell you more about our practice session today. Miss, the voice was clear, right? Yes, it was clear. Thank you so much. Aisha, are you ready? Yes. Ms. Dina will put a timer for each activity, so please open the activities with me from now while I'm explaining to you. First, there will be certificates for different categories, so be prepared to gain one. Every student have to go to the LMS, Chapter 8, Lesson 4, and open the Padlet and go to your group. As you could see here, here is group A, B, C, D, E. And then each group have to go to class click and solve slide 1 and slide 2. Each group have different code, so you have to enter by your group code. And then and then return to the Padlet. Every group have CCQ question. You will have 10 to 15 minutes to, to finish. Under each group, there is CCQ question, and every group have different questions than the other groups. So, Salama, how many time, how many minutes you are having for the first task? We have 10 to 15 minutes. And what are the slides you will be solving? Slide one. Abrar, where you will put your answer for the CCQ question? In the Padlet under my group. When you will finish answering your CCQ question in the Padlet, you will be having 10 minutes to discuss with Ms. Dina. Each group will have between 1 to 2 minutes maximum. Marwa, how many minutes each group will have to discuss the CCQ question with Ms. Dina? Each group will have between 1 to 2 minutes maximum. Last but not least, return to class kick and you will have an exit ticket in slide three. You will have 10 minutes to finish the exit ticket. Lastly, if you need help, you will go to the support material column, as you can see here. And there is many videos and edu share link in the LMS that will help you to understand more if you are struggling with something. Lastly, and if you are done and you want more activities, you will go to the stretching materials. And and you will 
and you will have an activity in Alex and more practices in the book. And also you have quizzes. You can do it to practice more. And before you leave the class, you have to go to the bad to the Padlet last column and do the self assessment. Write your understanding of learning objective one and two. Jawahar, can you tell me where could we do the self assessment? And the Padlet and the last column. Thank you, Jawahar. Oh, thank you so much for my assistance after this explanation. Now, please refer to your group. I will be starting the first timer, which is 10 to 15 minutes for the class kick slide one and two. And for the just let me show you and for the CCPU. So now I will share my screen on the timer and I will be following up with you. You can start now. All of you, please log in to ClassKick so I can follow up. Also, remember that you can visit each other and solve together. My group, Group C, please, when you have finished, all of you raise your green hand to be the winner today, our group. Thank you, Marwa. Ladies, can you please, if you are solving in your notebook to attach your solution, I would like to see it step by step.
please see the screen to see the time. If you are not paying attention to it, you are having around nine minutes. So leaders, it's your time to check up on your teams. Ladies, some of you 
are forgetting to solve some questions which lead that you are having subtraction in the marks. Four minutes left. If all your group, uh, group is done, please raise your hand. Two minutes left. Miss, our group is done. Now we will go to the CCQ. Great, please. Ladies, if you are done from the class kick, you can then upload your work of the CCQ. We will be having a quick discussion on it. Great, so I can see most of the groups are done. Miss. Yes, lovely. I am uploading the photo uh, for the solving the question. OK, lovely, but pay attention. You are having F, G, H and J. You don't have A. So yes, you can Ms. change uh, it. I, yes, I will change it, but I am trying to put the photo. But it's not working. That's I don't fine. Know. Change it. Change it first, then put the photo. OK, okay Ms. Good. So ladies, pay attention to the time. 18 seconds left or less. And we will be starting the discussion of the CCQ. Aya, can you raise your yellow hand?
Thank you so much, Aisha. I can see in your group also another student is raising her yellow hand. Fatma Malik, you forgot one of the questions. Ms. Dina. Yes, lovely. Miss, I want to ask my group one question. Yes, ask them. What do we call the number that uh, it's not correct? It's it's correct, but when we check, it gives us not the same number. What do we call the the word? that we always forget it. Again, Hadija, can you repeat it? Can you repeat the word again? Extraneous solution. Excellent. Extraneous no, she's solution. not Khadija. She's Shahad. Really? Shahad, same voice. <laughs> I'm really sorry, Shahad. OK, <laughs> so thank you so much, ladies. Thank you so much, Marwa. So we are done of class kick slide one and two and the CCQ of it. Now we are having our discussion, ladies. Are you ready? Of course. Good. So each group will only have from one to two minutes, not more than this. OK, ladies. So each group start first of all with your question, then Present your answer. And if you are having an audio, don't forget to share the audio. Group A, you can start. After group A, I will, uh, I will take a group C, then B. Give me a minute, miss. Good. If anyone who is prepared and would like to go before group A, that's fine for me. Aisha, you are muted. Hi, I am Aya. I am in a group A. I am with Aisha, Jamaa, Abraham, Moza, Khadija, and Elvino. Our CCQ question is: What is the sympathy sympathy for the logarithmic parent function? First of all, let's repeat it all together. Aisha, can you repeat with your group? Asymptote. 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 Great, thank you. You can answer now. The asymptote for the logarithmic function is y axis and for the exponential function is x axis. Let me ask a question. If it is the y-axis, what will be the equation of it? I want the answer from your group. So what's the equation of the y-axis? y equal log base p of x so this is the general form of the logarithmic function right but what do i mean by the equation of the y axis salama answered it can you raise your voice salama salama right i think salama answered it already raise your voice salama
Yes. Any group can answer this. What is the equation for y axis? X equal b to the power. Not the logarithmic. In general, any y axis, the y axis in general, what is the equation of it? X equal zero. Excellent. Thank you so much, ladies. So let's go to group C. Miss, we still have something. Ah, OK, you can present it. Good. Aisha, your time. So here we graphed y is equal log base 4 of x and it's a logarithmic function and the asymptote as you as you can see it is y axis as you can see here. Thank you so much for this indication. Let's now go to group C. Are you ready? Yes, miss. Good. Other groups, please be prepared so you can share your screen directly. How can we link? Please choose Marwa to explain. Yes, thank you, Maria. How can we, how can we link the concept of asymptotes to the included value from the domain? First, the asymptote is having value. I'm really sorry for interruption. It is excluded values. Excluded value. The the asymptote is having a relationship with the excluded value. Uh, that the same line of the asymptote will be the same vertical line that we can draw it. Uh, at the excluded value and the excluded value is the same as the asymptote uh, we will draw it and the excluded value the same as here is x equal 5 this is the excluded value excellent thank you so much thank you so much group c for indication do you have something else no miss thank you for listening most welcome. Group B. After B, I will take D, then E. We are group B. We choose Salamat to be our representative about the CCQ question. Rawa, you are not sharing your screen. Lovely. Solving logarithmic equation and equation. Uh, the equation for wind speed W in meals per hour. Salama, I apologize for interruption, but what is your question? Can you show them? What's your question? For the sake of time, let me take a screenshot from my side so they can follow up with you. Ladies, you will be having the CCQ question on the chat. And now, Salama, you can continue. The equation for wind speed W in the meals per hour near the center of a tornado is W equal 93 log base 10 of D plus 65. As we can see in this equation, we have a translation where D is the distance in meals that tornado travel. 
So on this question, we can use the logarithmic function and equation to know the wind speed when we have a tornado. I will use the general formula. It is x equal p to the power y. So I will solve it. As we can see, minus 65 both sides, then divided by 93. Then I will rewrite it. It will be d equal 10 to the power w minus 65 over 93. In May of 1999, of tornado devastated Oklahoma City with the fastest wind speed ever recorded. If the tornado traveled 525 miles, estimated the wind speed near the center of a tornado. So it's already give me in the first question the equation. I will just substitution the D that give me. It's 525 then to get the answer, which is 330. Thank, you, thank so you so much, Salama, and your group. Great examples about the tornado. Great. Thank you so much. Now, group E or D, any of you. If you are ready, share your screen. Group D. Hello, we are Group D and I'm Nahla. I will be the presenter. I will present our question, which is how the pH concentration related to logarithmic equation. In chemistry, pH is the measure of the acidity or basicity of a liquid. The pH is related to the concentration of hydrogen ion measured in moles per liter. Why the equation pH equal minus log between bracket hydrogen ion? We can see question here. It will help you in chemistry. So you can visit our column group D in the Padlet and solve the question. There is answer with explanation too. Thank you for listening. Thank you so much. So please visit their group and you can solve it alone. Group E. Let's end with the last group. Hi, I am Maryam Akesh from Group E. Our CCQ question is, can you evaluate the logarithm of negative or zero value? No, because the logarithm of a negative and zero value is undefined. We try to graph the function using this mode, and as we can see, there is no graph, which means it is undefined. Thank you so much. And this is one of the common misconceptions that may happen in the exam or anywhere in the class. So whenever you are having negative or zero value in taking the logarithmic function or equation then it is undefined good so now lastly let's go to our exit ticket which is slide three in the class kick whenever you are done raise your green hand i will put the timer for you and whenever you are done from the exit ticket please do the self-assessment at the last column
around six minutes left for the exit card and self-assessment. Ladies, when you write your rating, you can just write a text or add a comment with the percentage. It's better than rating using the stars. Around three minutes left. I can see that most of the groups are done of the exit ticket. So can you come to teams and raise your hand whoever is done from the exit ticket? Great. One minute left, around one minute, yes. please. Yes, dear. Our group have finished everything. Great. So uh, this is for Marwa's group. Can each leader open the microphone and confirm? I checked all the groups, they are all done. Are you still helping someone? Thank you so much.
I checked all the groups, all are done. MashaAllah, I can see that uh, some of you even graphed and who wrote this comment? Please next time write your name. Who wrote this comment yeah, for I more? Yes, I wrote Thank the comment for the girls in my group. Excellent. I can see Aisha. I can see, but please next time write your name next to the comment. I can see comments, but I didn't know who is the one. Good. Thank you, Aisha. So, ladies, at the beginning, at the beginning, I was telling you that there will be certificates for the most cooperative team, fast team, best leader in following up, best group member in helping the colleagues. So, most cooperative team A and E, I can see that they are supporting each other in comments and helping each other, uh, others using the yellow hand. So thank you so much, group A and E, excellent. But that doesn't mean that other teams are not helpful. They are helping each other. But next time, write more comments and help each other inside the pages. Fast team, group B. OK, sorry for this voice. It is for the timer. So the first team, group B. Uh, wait, uh, Marwa, I think you are group C, sir. So, uh, I'm really sorry for this mistake. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. So the first team is group C. Marwa's group really finishing everything with helping each other. Great team. Thank you so much. Keep being like this. And this leader, Marwa, thank you so much. You were oh, initiative, you. you were asking. Thank you so much. Best group member, Amn al Qabu'i, you were putting your solutions and you were helping even each other. And I would like to have a special thank for Aisha Jum'a for assisting me in the practice session for solving the logarithmic equations. And what happened? Okay, so it was uh, uh, there another certificate for Marwa. I'm really sorry, Marwa. I don't know what happened to my laptop today. So I will be modifying this and I will be sending you the certificate because I just added the name. So pardon me if I uh, have any mistake in the certificate. Have a great day. Thank you so much. If you have something to add, let me know. Bye, Miss. Have a good day. Have a great day, all of you. James, bye. Bye. Have a great day, all of you. Thank you so much for this great job. Keep going. Uh, thank you, Ms. Dina, for having me. And thank you for the lovely girls. Most welcome. Hi. You are welcome at any time. <laughs>